Okay, someone should send this to Wrestling Jesus or the Off the Rope Show. I think that the WWE, the first thing they need to get rid of isn't a talent or someone who works for their... It's a clause, a specific clause, the rematch clause. I think that the rematch clause is one of the prime examples of the reason why titles change hands in a hot potato effect, as CM Punk has said before. A lot of people, they win a title, but they don't succeed with a lot of title defenses because of the rematch clause. Like Rey Mysterio. What about Randy Orton in his third world title run? Or what about Christian? Christian has never won a title defense for a world title in the WWE. In TNA, he won a title defense for the NWA title. But that's about it. We need more title defenses. That's what's gonna make or break this uh, company, I think. We need more title defenses from people that can hold long title reigns and less title defenses and, and these kind of matches from guys that we see all the time because of the rematch clause. Do you really think they work? We if we have the rematch clause repealed or removed, that we're still going to ha see Cena all the time in these pay-per-view matchups? Of course not. Because someone else might get a chance if he doesn't have this clause that protects him from having to start in the bottom once he loses his title. I think it should be that once you lose your title that you have it to start from the bottom or win a number one contenders match. But definitely not have this rematch clause. It's ridiculous. So let me know what you guys think in the comments section. Do you agree with this? Do you disagree with this? I'm curious. Because really, to me, this sounds like it'd help a lot of people out in WWE. It'd help out a lot of future main eventers. Because in my opinion... This is getting off the deep end. This is getting annoying. Alright, so this is Mr. Wonka 7 or Leon Red. Let me know what you think and suck my dick.